No one wants to cut down a majestic shade tree that took decades to grow. Yet trees are notorious water and light hoggers and won't share their territory with just any plant. Fortunately, there are many perennials that may be used to create an attractive and harmonious landscape under a tree. Number one, Siberian bug loss. Not only does Siberian bug loss spread slowly, forming a colony of plants that can be utilized to fill in the space beneath the tree or transplanted to other sections of the garden. But it is also a hardy perennial that flowers frequently in zone three conditions. The soil doesn't need to be too rich or too dry, although some plants perform better in richer conditions. Number two, wild ginger. The wild ginger is a native ground cover plant that requires very little maintenance. The spring blooms may be unremarkable, but the heart-shaped leaves make up for it. Since wild ginger has a tendency to crowd out its neighbors, it's better to grow it in a solitary setting. From USDA hardiness zones four to eight, you can plant it without worry. Number three, lily of the valley. The lily of the valley is a hardy spring flower with a pleasant smell. Despite its delicate bell-shaped flowers, Convalaria majilis is an effective ground cover that can swiftly cover any bare place in the garden, even the thin, hard soil under mature trees. Zones three through nine are suitable for growing lily of the valley. Number four, bleeding heart. Even when not in bloom, Decentra plants add a unique texture to the garden. The plant's pendulous pink heart-shaped flowers are named for their delicate appearance against the plant's finely split leaves. Put a bird bath there if the space left under your trees is unsightly. It is USDA hardiness zones three through nine where bleeding hearts will flourish. Number five, periwinkle. If you want a tough plant, periwinkle will do the trick. But be warned that vinca minor plants can be vigorous enough to become a bit of a problem in a mixed planting area. These plants are perfect for preventing soil erosion since they thrive in areas where nothing else will grow, such as under trees. Their comfort zone extends from four to nine. Number six, Japanese painted fern. The Japanese fern prefers shade but its colors show up most vividly in dappled light. The Japanese fern, like all other ferns, requires consistent moisture. When applied in a three inch layer, mulch helps keep moisture in the soil and prevents weeds from competing with ferns and trees. Usually the hardiness range for the Japanese painted fern is zones five through eight. Number seven, daffodil. Planting early blooming species of the Narcissus genus under deciduous trees can help them catch the sunshine they need to fuel future blooms before the trees leaf out. At any point in the fall, before the ground freezes, plant bulbs at a depth of at least three inches. A daffodil that can survive in climates as cold as zone three. Number eight, foam flower. Runners on healthy plants will quickly disseminate the plant's genetic material, creating a clump of lobe leaves with red veins that is visually appealing but not aggressive. If your tree canopy is dense enough to act as an umbrella, the foam flowers under its protection will benefit from an inch of water once a week. Foam flowers may thrive in zones three to eight. Number nine. Hosta. Hostas are common, but never boring thanks to intensive breeding efforts that have resulted in a wide range of sizes, colors, and leaf shapes for use in under tree gardens. Hostas are slow growing perennials that spread out over time. Well, thanks for watching video from Catchy Garden. 
Don't forget to click like and subscribe button to always support our channel. You can also turn on the notification bell to get the latest videos from us. We'll see you in the next videos.